Hello guys, Steven here back with another video and I just found out that I have never done a profile picture tutorial. So today I'm going to make a really simple one for you guys. If you guys want to, you know, how to make a really professional one, uh, you can click off this video because this is a really simple one for beginners. So uh, first thing you want to do is press file new. And then what you want to do here is select pixels and transparent background contents. The width and height of an avatar is 500. So just type that in, press OK once you're done. And here you can see there's a square with the transparent uh, inside. That means the background is trans. <laughs> and that means the background is transparent. So the first thing you want to do is add in your text. So what I recommend is just doing the short form of your channel name. So you know the text is really emphasized because if you make it you know small text like if I write Steven Van, it's really hard to see. Um, I actually didn't am doing that with my current profile picture. Uh, I should have done SV, but I did uh, Steven Van. But it's all up to you. So I just think SV is a little bit better. So what you want to do is increase the font until it actually fits most of um, the square. So I'll do 300 maybe um, a little more. So maybe 400. And then what you want to do is center it. How you do this is as simple as this. Just press control A, select on the layer, press this a select tool, press this, press this, and then shift center, press control D to just select. And then what I'm going to do here is go on to uh, blending options, right click on the text layer, press blending options, go to gradient, go and change the opacity to 15%, go into drop shadow, don't change anything. And outer glow here, the color you select is the color um, of your text. So if you have red text, make um, the outer glow white, uh, red. And um, I have white text, so I'll make it, be making it white. And here the size should be 43, opacity should be 25. Oh, uh, here 25 blend mode should be normal and that's it for the text and so here i'm done here and then what you want to do next is find the profile uh, the background of the profile picture so i have one right here i already downloaded it so go on to file place to you uh, place in any background you want and then i'll just add it right here and then here you can see that it's not fully covered so what you want to do is hold shift and just drag the image right there. Press OK and center everything. Okay, first uh, make sure to move the text right here. Move it up. And what you want to do is press Control A on the actually Control A on the background. Press Control A. And here we're gonna center it again. Press Control D to deselect. Next thing and final step we're gonna do is press onto the background. Press filter. Press blur. Press um, Gaussian Blur, and here you can blur as much as you want. It's all up to you. So maybe I want to do like that. So that is the end of the video. Maybe it isn't how you want it to be. Um, you can change it up. The background doesn't look that good with this text, but you can always change the backgrounds and you know mess around with the settings and stuff. So that is the end of the video. If you can reach 100 likes on this video, that would be great. My name is Steven, and I'll see you in the next one.